Now another breaking news update. Police continuing their search for the shooter that killed a beloved store owner. We first brought you this sad story yesterday morning. Now Chicago police have new surveillance video. They're hoping will help them catch the killer. CBS 2's Assal Rezai is live in Westridge. Good morning, Assal. Yeah, good morning, Ryan Audrina. Police still tell us that shooter is on the loose this morning and they have released new surveillance video of that suspect. It shows him inside of the store before, during and after that shooting. Take a look. You can see that suspect coming up to the J&K Liquors here on a bike. This is around 10 o'clock Sunday night on Northwestern Avenue here in Westridge. The video shows the suspect covering what appears to be a COVID type face mask. He briefly talks with the store owner before before he shoots and kills him. He's then seen running from the store, dropping a cell phone, leaving behind that bicycle we see on the side of the store. The store owner, Salim Kamo, died from that gunshot. He was 66 years old, immigrated here from Iraq, where he was raising his family and he was going to retire next month. He loved his grandchildren more than anything. Anytime one of them walked through the store, he was the happiest man in the world. Now, his family and community here say they are heartbroken. There is actually a small vigil with some candles here set up in front of the store this morning. They say he was a role model here in their community. We do know that he did return gunfire without hitting that robber who ran off without stealing anything. Police continue their search for that shooter this morning. We're live in Westridge. SL Rezai, CBS 2 News. SL, thank you so much for those updates and just a horrible story this morning.